Alright guys, so what's up though? I'm playing back to today, of course. Got a really, really, really quick to come out video. Wanted to do it really quick, of course. Sorry about saying that, my throat kind of hurt a little bit. Um, last kind of video, if you guys, um, next thing you know, I did, I can't remember what video I did beforehand, so yeah, back with another quick talking about video, of course, should've choked me right now, cause I did get a new one for Christmas right here, Evolution Blue Vegeta, looking nice, looking sharp, I know you guys saw my underbelly right there, but of course, we have some new global news right now, we have a new Angel Gordon Freezer coming to global right now, of course, you gotta know, you gotta know who is this, it actually is a really good Gordon Freezer right here, I mean, he pretty much does almost everything in the game, he dodges, he stuns, he, um, not crits, but he dodges, stuns, he does a lot of things for his guys, so yeah, um, I did move up a little bit more from my camera. I did move up a little bit from my camera position because, you know, I want to be a little bit more closer. Um, still feels right a little bit though because, you know, some parts seem off, some parts seem okay. But yeah, um, of course, um, yeah. So yeah, all, again, a lot of some of those older videos that I did are some of them are, again, pushing back, pushing forward, and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, um, the new Angel Golden Freezer actually is really solid though. He actually is a really good unit. Um, I'd say it's like one of the top five units in the game. Yes, it's really solid though. Again, we have some of the other units now. I actually did go back, watch some older videos for Frieza. I see him, he actually is really good though. He's actually really good. I love how he stacks defense. Again, I'm going to go over more when they come out and stuff like that. I will do a video for that and join off the event and stuff like that. Of course, like I always, always usually do. Again, try to do something new like that, of course. Um, so, of course, um, and Global's getting a new world tournament we got the day I downloaded for his guys a couple of days ago, of course. Um, then, of course, right here, I just need to go to Frieza's banner. I'm gonna go to the second. I know we're getting a new prep battle with, which that means we got like a new Bulma's battle prep. So basically, that means we're getting a little tournament right here. So yeah, um, we're getting the Gohan right here, um, Vegito, Android 8, or Aider. Um, yeah, of course, this is tying up with JP's World Tournament and stuff like that, of course. It's always kind of typical right there um, for JP's World Tournament. So it's actually really good right there, of course. So yeah, um, again, for instance, actually, his banner actually is really good. I actually meant to scroll down for his banner. He actually is really good. It has a lot of good units on here. I actually meant to pull up the New Year's, New Year's Temple banner because we are getting one probably tomorrow, today, at the time of recording. I don't, I don't know when we're going to upload this video. Because again, no, some of my videos are being pushed back, but for I don't know which one I'm gonna upload. I might upload this one soon, next probably. I'm um, probably tomorrow, new, not new year, but before new year happens, because I always upload the combat video beforehand. Plus, Global will probably get the official one of the new year stuff, which we got the last couple years for JP and Global. We are gonna have the new year step up in it probably. Um, but uh, you know that night, you know that night, honestly. So, yeah, like your reset time, like your actual like login reset time, like seven o'clock, eight o'clock, that's usually for me because they like saving is going on. Um, Again, like for this Fraser right here, his banner actually is really good. His banner is really good. Um, yeah, it actually, I don't know, I just paused, I just paused it for like a second. Um, his banner actually is really good though, honestly. His banner is really good. Um, let, me get, let me scoot up a little bit more too. His banner actually is really good. Actually, my Max is killing me right now. Jeez. Um, let's go a little bit more. So yeah, the banner actually is really good though, honestly. Frieza is good, he's amazing, Beerus is good. I feel like they could change him out, but I don't feel like they're doing that with Global. Because his Beerus has been back a lot more on Global recently. Um, he just came back on the Fusion Banner. We could see a change because he just came back again. We don't know what it's going to be. If it is, uh, I'm going to be shocked. If it's like, oh, going to go 10 again, I'm, a, I'm throwing I'm, I'm throwing the banner out the window. I'm going to be like, hey, nice stone. Yeah. But it's going to be hard to kind of save up the recommend summoning because go, it's either go save up for the New Year's Step Up Banner or summon on this. Um, again, because all these guys are going to be available with coins soon. Kaiken Goku is good. Cool is amazing. Spear Bomb, um, Spear Bomb Goku is still amazing. Um, Triple Trick from Frieza is still amazing. Good Frieza is still amazing. He does all your allies attack. You're trying to show him off like on a showcase for your heroes specifically. But yeah, for Super Battle Road, we're going up against like universe like what? Like universe like universe you know, probably a lot of units or whatever. Um, they're heroes. So they're gonna be good. Um, he's probably gonna be really good for that. Frieza again, he's amazing. Like he's really good. Again, he's stacked defense, which I really love about that about him. I love about, about his kit. But yeah, overall though, his banner is really good. I probably would recommend summoning on it because you know after this week, February will probably be Gogeta. I'm um, highly. We'll probably be in Gogeta. Um, that'll be another banner coming out. I think Bojack could be like, no, what's after that? No, Bojack's probably like a little bit beforehand. So Global is gonna be probably move really fast after this. They have been doing it for like couple, last couple of months. They've been moving really, really fast. So all these banners are getting pushed back, pushed up a little bit better. Um, Global has had this drawback kind of sometimes like for I think this freezer actually made to pull up this easy eight freezer right here. Um. Right here? Okay. Yeah, this is easy freezer right here. Uh, he got pushed back almost like a year. I think it's what, like, yeah, it came out like, oh wait, April, so what, May 2019 for JP's um, easy and stuff like that. Um, yeah, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. So, what, eight, almost a whole year? Um, eight months usually, so yeah. Um, Global Head is a drawback, of course, like I said, with World Tournaments and stuff like that. Um, even this budget event right here, that got pushed back also for Global. It just come back. It did just come back for Ella Gohan's Awakening for its um, you know, LR stuff like that. So it's really good. This is the timeline of events. Um, 
Also, with this Frieza celebration, we should have the next battlefield because a lot of people were complaining, oh yeah, where's the next battlefield? When's the next battlefield? When LR Bobbity Boon, you know, LR Bobbity and Devora. They should be the next battlefield unit. I will actually show them up on screen really quick after this. So yeah, this should be the next battlefield for Global Oil's enemies and stuff like that. Um, of course, it doesn't get replaced with Golden Frieza. Yeah, not really that impressive. Jiren looks a lot better, in my opinion. I agree with Truth. Um, I've been watching, rewatching a lot of his videos for Dokken because he did, I realize he does a lot of Dokken Battle videos. That man's insane. Nice job for that guy. So yeah. I'm sure you begin this LR Boo and Bobby and Deborah. Really good for Global, kind of late to the party a little bit because we just had the Boo Saga celebration and JP just getting there on, um, you know, LR, you know, LR Boo and um, um, Bobby. So, yeah, again, Bobby's getting a lot of love this year. Good job for him. Good girl, at least give him an SSR. But next, you know, you can't keep his SSR. He does have SSR from there. I think he's pretty okay. They kind of did with Prime Battle events where the SSR is different from the TR. TR is always usually, you know, a second character or, you know, it's always permanent transformation or whatever. Yeah, this guy's actually really good as well. He actually, again, he's really good. Um, they do a lot of good things as well. Probably like one of the best free to play LRs in the game. Uh, probably on their list. Um, again, they're both really good. Um, the only thing I kind of looked up as, um, I was looking up the categories to kind of get pull them up on like Inhuman Deeds. Um, they're not Inhuman Deeds. They really should be on there. I don't know why they didn't do that. They really need to change that for Global. Global bend that spots. Everybody out there, guy ready to target me because I said, oh, free to play is better. <laughs> um, um, They'd be on Inhuman Deeds because Bobbity kills Popovich and Deborah kills um um Yamu. Um the hey, Bobbity's other oh, henchman, he, like human henchman he kills. They really should be they need to be on Inhuman Deeds. I, I don't know why they need they need to change that. So yeah. They have a good buff for the Majin Boo um or no Majin power category, basically only Boo's on there. It should have been just like Majin they need to make like a new like a demon room like a category, which is probably will, or like a demon clan or whatever. They're gonna make that properly in the future. And they also should make like a um like a, like a Majin, like, like again, like, I was going say Majin Power, but that's already a thing now. It should have been, like, all people who've been controlled by Bobbity. As I've seen this more and more and more as time goes on, I do highly agree that that does need to be a category in the future. That really does need to be a category. So they should change that as well. So, like I said, though, they really need to be on the human deeds. Um, maybe, yeah, in the future, we should get, like, a, like, at least, like, a Wicked Sorcerer category or whatever. Um, I, I'll say, um, Body of Mind and Extinction or whatever. That's boot. That is generally the category. Basically, everybody's either been mind controlled or bot swap, body swap. So, essentially, Almost body swapped it, essentially, or cooked in another evil way. It could be a leader for that, though, because they, again, they corrupt like Vegeta and, like, you know, against both of the job. Dvorah's in that category, so they could be on that category for Bobby. They should be, huh? no, because, um, no, Bobby's controlling Dvorah, and they're both in the Carter at the same time, so yeah, that makes sense. So they should be the next LR for Gold, but again, they do ties to celebrations, like I said, just for Golden Frieza and Bojack because Mint and stuff like that. So, what was this? So, this is Frieza on Piccolo. Okay, so Frieza taking up Piccolo's time slot from last year. This isn't new, by the way. Um, and stuff like that. And also, the part LR should be a new unit. Um, last year we got Cell, which I was not, uh, which I did not lie, because he was the first year, um, he was from Global specifically. He was, um, first LR from the new year, or something like that. So, that makes sense. I was thinking, because with the Golden Frieza trend, um, celebration right here, um, I, I kind of went back over it and stuff like that. And up here is like the banner and stuff like that, like a little bit beyond that. I was actually looking it up and I was like, holy crap. Um, I'm just going to freeze this event. Actually, just going to here. Um, we should be getting a new story event for this freezer right here. Um, him like resurrection of training, like, is him training before resurrection of starts. Him going to go and freeze it into a bay unit, they are a free play unit. They should have gotten an ETA, but again, I'll go over more when they come out. It's more of a kind of preview video for Global. We should be getting all these again, even though Global just got them. That should be good. Um, New Battlefield, we should be getting a new chain battle as well. And Kibbutz ETA probably in the celebration as well. Again, they always tie to celebrations. It's just a new copy and paste of a, like a more suicide ish, okay version of the um, Pudgy Sack Machine event, whatever. I'm not gonna really do a video on that because it's kind of a waste of time. Um, that's pretty exciting. Um, this one down here, we should be getting an LR. Is that the LR Trolls or LR um, Jiren? Probably I had LR Jiren because with this celebration, we could get an easy 8 and felt we could get an easy 8 for Topo and Dispo right here. This is what right, Dispo right here in Topo. Um, this one right here. Um, we should get, be getting their ETAs with this event. Um, uh, it does make sense because you know, Jiren being the part two LR, or they could hide it and be like, okay, we're having LR Jiren next week or the week after. Um, it does make sense that Jiren being new year because a lot of people are gonna be like, oh, Hybrid Sonic, we didn't get him for Tenabata Christmas. <laughs> why? 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 <laughs> why? I know everybody's, I know, I'm just saying, I'm like, the video straight. I mean, I'm, a, I'm an idiot. Um, I'm a fool right now, so yeah. Um, 
we should see their EZAs with the celebration. It makes sense, tournament of power and stuff like that. It is what Kellen Close was EZA. They got pushed back because, you know, before the down celebration happened, that's when we got, um, you know, we're supposed to get Kellen Close was EZA with their event, but we never got that for global. So, yeah, again, this being pushed back doesn't really matter. I don't really care because, you know, everybody's going to complain. Oh, yeah, he came out with like the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. As out of that, our turrets, I feel like turrets could be after Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. That could be in April. I'll say next month at this point. Um, should be April because next month, like, uh, like a, what, a day and a half now <laughs> at this point. So, yeah, new year. Hopefully, you guys had a good year 2020. I know overall this year was bad for you guys. For me, specifically, though, it was okay. I know for the world it was bad, but um, for my YouTube channel, actually, it was really good. Besides July, I hate July. That was horrible. Never doing that again. Never uploading like seven different videos a day. No, I'm doing it all in one go. Because a lot of videos did get pushed back a little bit um, late, early. So, yeah, that kind of threw off my uploading schedule. So, yeah. It was good for the channel overall, more videos, but at the same time, it's like. Um, it, I was drained out, tired, I was over cluttered. Never doing that again. Forget those approval wishes. Forget them, forget them, forget them. Heck it, heck it. Never, 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 never again. Never again, never again, never again. Hey, but what's gonna get back a little bit though? So yeah. Um, I've seen toilet banner, but this banner sucks. It sucks, it's bad. The only good videos over here are probably this Frieza, um, this Frieza. Um, the Frieza is pretty okay. You're a pretty good forward tournament. Brad's is a good for Super Battle Royale. That's pretty much it, honestly. This, again, you're going to see these guys on every other banner, so that's why I kind of say you don't summon all these banners because, for example, like, you could summon. Oh, yeah, get this Brad's. Oh, wait, I'm going to summon and get him again in a different banner. Like, for his banner, for example. This actually good, has, has really good high value because these guys don't come back as often. Like, these guys are. They cool, just came back tons of times for Global because the you Odell know, celebration. But before that, we didn't, like, you know, Frieza came out, you know, I think. October, coolest time slot, this coolest time slot, because the year before that was like, I think 2018 was, Halloween was cooler, AGL made it cooler, then this year, last year was cooler, then this year's Frieza, so we're going to see another week of Bloodline, so just evil villain for like October, it makes sense, because it's always been that time slot, and we're like April-ish, I want to say for Global, like May, for Global specifically, that's when they get like, the Doka Fest celebrations, the New Year's one, like for PyCon and Geneva that just came out right now, but Global will say that like in May. It's always been like that. We've seen it with Majin Vegeta and Super Saiyan 3, Angel Goku, and Majin Vegeta. We're going to see it there. So, yeah. Um, Trailers, I probably don't feel like it. He will make sense more with Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta because him just being insane and stuff like that. Um, I mean, Frieza, I mean, cool. Is, actually, no, because Frieza didn't actually make sense either. Because, um, yeah, Frieza didn't make sense either because of, um, whatchamacallit. Yeah, Frieza didn't make sense either because um he Charles just came out randomly. It is he came out in a weird time because he came out near Halloween, like a couple of days before Halloween, and, um, um, Halloween and, um, um, before Halloween, uh, before Halloween celebration for Global and Halloween on JP. Really weird. He kind of came out at a weird time slot, so I thought he was, like, on Halloween. Makes sense, because, you know, background, evil, wicked tree, whatever. Um, you know, trick or treat, whatever, trees, whatever, shit. Um, just a little bit makes more sense. I don't feel like it's gonna be like that. Um, we should be getting new extreme, extreme, you know, new chain battle event as well. We always World tournament cards. I know a lot of people aren't gonna have all these because new players are not gonna have all these guys. For me, I have been playing for a really long time, so I pretty much have everybody on here besides the STR Super Saiyan Vegeta from the um, Android Cell, Cell Slash, um, Android Arc, AGL Vegeta is gonna get the Again, it's mainly just World tournament units. The best unit you can use is a TN Jiaotu, but I don't feel like he's gonna, uh, he's just gonna come early for Global because we just had, a we just recently had a chain battle and we just got those rewards. About a couple weeks ago, I need, need to make a chain battle video for the um, equipment pools. We should be getting, um, it should be this one, and the Global just really got one. I don't feel like they're gonna do chain battle back to back, but they could replace something, you know, they could have a, you know, double LR banner with this, you know, New Year, starting off the New Year and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's pretty much it, honestly, though. That's all I really want to go with today. And we should be getting a little time on right here. Um, again, in Kid Boots Easy, I actually went over all that. And now, like, if I scroll down more, let's do like the World Tournament stuff, you know, Chi Chi and I'm Grandpa Gohan Awakening. So we got your Halloween. Those should be next World Tournament. Again, the time this will go, because I did check it out. So Global only behind like three World Tournaments, I believe. So we should kind of see that sooner or later ish. For Global, again, um, it'd be cool they caught up with World Tournaments at the same time. You know, we already got prizes and stuff like that. So next World Tournament prize, actually, should be the Snow Goku. It's gonna come out at a weird time slot because you know that's near Christmas. This is like beyond the New Year and stuff like that. But hey, over the New Year with the new world with the world tournament. You don't know how it's gonna be. I think it's actually on New Year's Day. Is this the it said the thirty first? So it could be a couple more hours. A, a day and a half, probably you want to pronounce this here. And we should be getting this new sale in Frieza Awakenings. Again, it's the new Frieza for from Frieza and Sorbet. Um, Golden Frieza, Sorbet and Golden Frieza is for the Awakening 2. And beforehand is the first form Frieza. So, highly though, in my opinion, I'm going to keep both versions. I always do this all the time. Keep both versions. For Gobo, it will be different. Like, everybody's been, been complaining about that for months. The Angel Frieza and Cell should be different. Um, they probably are because I think on JP sell stack defense and he doesn't on Gobo and Frieza is a little bit different. I think he has more of a super stack buff than he does. Yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I want to go about today. Again, 
Um, I think we should see those guys again. I, I want to go through more when it comes out. So yeah, I'm gonna go in the video here. Like I said, the Freeza Cell Awakenings will be a little bit different on Global because again, I'm gonna read those out anyway, though. You know when they come out. So yeah, again, when it fully comes out, I'll you know do a event on the. I'll do a video for the event anyway because I do have the Freeza and Cell. I got Cell Rainbowed, but I don't have like. MSA 10, I think same thing goes for free, so I don't have MSA 10. I never really have probably use them anyway though, but I might use them as I see more in Super Battle Road and longer events. Because I am impressed with it. But it's an internet, but I'm really more impressed with him. So yeah. See you guys later though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, great life. Oh cool Jack again though. Happy New Year for you guys if it's if I'm gonna upload this before the new year, I probably will. So stay safe, wash your hands, God bless. Hopefully 2020 was a massive train wreck. Hopefully it'll be new next year. So wait guys, think about Angel Golden Frieza. You already know the homie girl actually got some before him, so yeah. Um his video is actually really good. I don't know, again. It's like yes, but at the same time, no. It's either something on this banner or the New Year's Temple banner because it's gonna be the New Year's Temple banner is gonna be first before this. So, yeah, again, um, so yeah, it's hard to say because that is guaranteed LR, you know, it basically like older player could have, have those category units. But talk about that more when it comes out, you know, last day, New Year, blah 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 blah. blah. So, yeah, see so you guys later though. I can know. Peace out.